Hello and welcome to the Outpost RV. My name is Jeremy and today we're going to take a look at the Wolfpup 18 RJB BLW. This camper comes in at 22 feet 8 inches tongue to bumper and weighs right at 3,900 pounds empty. As we get started up front here we have your power tongue jack with the LED light so you can see at nighttime if you're hooking up. We have a single 20 pound LP tank bottle that will be filled by the Outpost RV. We have your hard shell cover with a quick access lid, diamond plate rock guard, we have the curved radius front end. Part of the black label package is the high gloss gel coat fiberglass sidewalls here. We're gonna have the magnetic door latch, lots of storage up front, integrated LED light up there as well. The spare tire is included. Underneath at the very front, you'll notice with the white tag hanging off, there's an LP quick disconnect. So if you have a portable gas grill, you can take it with you and tap into that instead of taking another bottle with you. We have four manual jacks, two in the front, two in the back. We have this power awning where each leg is adjustable. So if the sun's coming down, you can adjust the pitch of the awning. We have the black tempered glass entrance door. Right above that, we have the bright LED light as well as a, um, it's gonna be a vent for your ventilation system. If you're hauling anything with fumes in it, you can open that up and keep it vented out as you're traveling down the road. Oversized grab handle. We have your black tempered glass entrance door. It has an integrated window with it and a full size screen door as well. Sturdy steps going in where each leg is adjustable. We also have the wolf head emblem cut out here. Cool feature that they've added. We have your outside speakers that light up blue. We have your outside TV bracket. It's the same bracket that they use on the insides. You simply lift your TV up, bring it out here and drop it in. Then we have your TV connections right over here. This camper has the adventure package, giving it a two inch lift, diamond plate metal along the bottom and the off-road tire here. You'll notice the center cap is popped off. It is the quick, easy lube axle. Both wheels have self-adjusting brakes and this tire pressure monitoring system. And how that works is this will turn red if you're low on air. So we'll unscrew that to demonstrate. That way you can walk around and do a visual check before you head off for your next destination. Here we have your leash latch, so the furry family members can tag along as well. As we move to the back of the camper, we have your patio system all set up. You'll notice the screen that goes all the way around here. It also has a screen wall that you can roll down to help keep the air in and the bugs out. It comes with a backup camera already included. It's got the bright LED light. There is also a moon shade included. It's hanging up on the side, right inside the uh, entrance there. And it's essentially a big dome that will cover the porch area to get you shade out here as well. Here is the other vent for that cross ventilation if you're hauling anything with fumes. Up top we have a ladder prep. So separately you could buy a telescoping ladder, hook it up there and get up to the roof for maintenance purposes. Down below there is going to be a sewer hose holder that they have attached underneath the camper. Here we have your black tank flush so when you're done camping for the week you can hook your water hose up here, clean out your black tank. We have your furnace vents. This is a 30 amp unit and it will come with a 25 foot detachable power cord. Here we have your outside light with its own on off switch, nice bright LED light. You have your dump station down below, black handle for the black tank, gray handle for the gray tank. Here we have your water fill station. We have your fresh water on the left. So if you're dry camping or boondocking, you'd fill up the fresh water tank on the camper, turn on your water pump and use that water. Over here on the right, we have your city water connection. So if you're at a campground, you hook your water hose up here and that'll pressurize the lines for you. Underneath, we have your outside shower with hot and cold water. And last but not least, we have your on-demand water heater. It is a tankless system, gas only, but you're only using gas when you're running hot water. So about 60% more efficient than what we used in the past. And that'll conclude our outside walkthrough of the Wolfpup 18 RJB BLW. And now we'll take a look at the inside. As we move to the inside here, you'll notice that we have the queen mattress off to the right with the overhead bunk. The bathroom is going to be straight ahead. We have your kitchen area over here on the right with that patio door down, really opens everything up here. And a couple really nice size windows over here as well. And we'll go ahead and get started right inside the door. We have your main control panel. We can see how full your tanks are. Turn your water pump on. There are also 12 volt heating pads on your holding tanks for cold weather camping. So you can turn those on and off there. And also run your awning in and out. We have your vent for the ventilation. If you have anything with fumes in here, 
TV connections up top with a bracket on the wall. We have this huge window here. And over here to the left, underneath the main control panel, we're gonna have your 110 outlet. You'll notice that we have lots of tie downs here. So about six of them all together. You can bring your motorcycle up, tie it down here, perfect for that, or four wheelers. We have some overhead storage here with another window right below it. You'll notice in the corner we have your moonshade set up there that is attached to the wall. In the back we have your dinette, which the table can also lay flat. Cushions can push together and turn into another sleeping area. Here's another look at the patio system here and the screen wall up top. You'll notice we have the blue interior speaker. We have a subwoofer and then over here on the top right we have another interior speaker that lights up blue. Over here in the corner, we have your voltmeter up top. There is currently 200 watts of solar already mounted on the roof, so you can keep an eye on your battery. And then we have your stereo, which is AM, FM, and Bluetooth compatible as well, so you can play music off your phone. Storage up top, we have your microwave, range vent that will vent to the outside, in the kitchen area, we have this huge kitchen window, two burner stove with the glass cover as well. So you can utilize that as prep space if you are not cooking. Also part of the black label package is gonna be the upgraded countertop. It is more of a solid surface countertop as opposed to the laminate. We have this large single bowl sink here. We have the built-in soap dispenser over there on the left, high rise faucet with the pull out sprayer. And then over here to the left, we have your 110 outlet and a 12 volt charge port with a USB and a USB-C charge port there. Down below, we're gonna have some storage. We'll go ahead and open these up. We have your trash can sitting inside on the bottom left hand side. Lots of storage up top here. Underneath that two burner stove, we're gonna have your furnace down below. And then underneath the refrigerator, we have your breakers and fuses. The red key is a 12 volt cutoff switch that will kill all 12 volt power to your battery when the camper is not in use. And then a CO2 detector. You'll notice we have the dual swing door. This is a 12 volt refrigerator, which is also why we have the 200 watts of solar up top to help run this while traveling down the road. The 12 volt refrigerators are much more efficient than the gas electric and they also cool down much quicker as well. But as you can see, you can open this door from the left or right hand side. And now we'll make our way up to the bedroom. Over here we have your thermostat for the furnace and that will turn that on and off for you. Up front we have your oversized queen mattress. The comforter is included. We have a window here at the foot of the bed Again, we have the overhead bunk. And if you didn't need that for sleeping, you could certainly remove that and have lots of storage up here as well. Up in the bedroom area, you get a nice bright LED light up there. Another window we're gonna get where you can have the reading lights or they can be on as a blue accent light as well. On the left, we have a 12 volt charge port. At the head of the bed, you'll notice that uh, we're gonna have this headboard up here. And there is also going to be some storage underneath. And over to the far right, we have that 110 outlet. It looks a little bit different. That has a built-in inverter. So as you're traveling down the road, if you pull over to a rest stop, you can hop in the camper, turn that inverter on, and have power to that 110 outlet right there. And now we'll step into the bathroom. Take a look here. Right inside, we have your toilet area. Over here to the right, on the wall, we have your digital thermostat, and that is for your on-demand water heater, so you can turn that on and off and adjust the temperature. We have some hooks on the wall there for hanging your towels. High-speed vent fan, that is also a multi-speed exhaust fan. Does a great job in here. We have the curtain that will pull across at an angle. The shower surround. And then also part of the black label package is this really fancy shower head. We have this waterfall head. You have the handheld sprayer over there to the right. 
And down below, there is two other places for the water to come out as well. We have a built-in sink over in the corner of the shower here. And as you'll notice, it is a shower pan. Lots of room down below here. And that will conclude our walkthrough of the Wolf Pup 18 RJB BLW. I really appreciate you guys watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact myself or Henry at 866-338-9845. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day.